And now we will see how to install Chime 2 after that we installed Conda. Chime 2 website has the installation instructions under the document. So we can go to installing Chime 2, natively installing Chime 2 with Miniconda. We really have a Conda, so we can take the instructions either for Mac OS or Linux. And this is a three step uh, installation. First, we download a configuration file with all the packages needed to create a new environment with the Chime 2. Then we create the environment using Conda or Mamba. And finally, we can remove the file that has been used just as a template. This is different than installing a, a package from Bioconda, like with Conda, install, minus C, Bioconda, Chime 2. Uh, but ensures that all the versions of all the libraries and all the dependencies are tightly controlled. So let's start by copying the wget command. Let's check that we download the correct file. So it's a, it should be a text file with a list of packages. And this is it. These are the channels that will be used. So defaults, Condaforge, Bioconda, and also a specific Chime 2 label R2021. For that is the version of Chime that we are going to install, and then a list of all the dependencies. With head, we just printed the first 10 lines. Now we can either conda env create minus n, I suggest to keep this so that every time you know exactly which version you installed, and then which file to use to uh, create the environment. So I will just copy the second part and I will use Mamba instead. Now, if we try to run Chime, it won't load because it has been installed in a dedicated environment. To list our current environment, so the environment that we have in our current installation, the command is conda info minus minus e and ds. So we just created a Chime 2 2021.4 environment, and to activate it, it's just a matter of conda activate Chime 2. 2021.4. Now, if we run Chime, we will see that Chime 2 has been installed and we can access the plugins from Chime 2. Within the Chime 2 environment, we can access Chime and all the packages that Chime installed for us. For example, vSearch. But usually, we cannot access the package that we didn't install in other environments. And so if we want to deactivate Chime 2 and go back to our base environment, the command is simply conda deactivate. 